Hi, and welcome to Studio Time with Zach. My name is Zachary Rudder. I'm an artist based out of Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. And on the easel this week, we got something fun for my friends at Frank's Bar and Grill. So let's head on inside and get set up. As you can see, a tight squeeze. But this is gonna be a massive mural that takes up all three of these walls here. This one's gonna be my most challenging mural yet, and I can't wait to get started. So this is my first time ever using scaffolding like this. Not gonna lie, I'm pretty nervous, but we got this. Now all that's left is to start the skeleton outline. Another time, baby. You can see I got the chalk outline. Unfortunately, I forgot my iPad and the reference sketch, so I've been having to use my phone to do all the skeleton outline. Uh, I got this to a point where I'm gonna start adding some paint. Let's get this outline going. Halfway done with the skeleton outline. I'm so bummed that I'm not able to do a time lapse of it, but I'll be sure to bring the right stuff with me for tomorrow. And let's get back to work. Not gonna lie, it is impossible to get some footage in this room just because of how narrow this hallway is. Uh, I got the first wall skeleton outline finished. I'm gonna clean this scaffolding up and call it a night. And then uh, hopefully they'll have that signed down when I come back. We'll get this wall and that wall completed before we start coloring things in. So day one in the books. All right, day two of working on this massive mural for my friends at Frank's Bar and Grill. Uh, we're taking this one slow because we're working around the bar's hours. So I just got another day of putting the outline on the wall. So we still got a lot of work to do. Let's get another day of work in the books. Day two, let's work on the North Shore. And I actually remembered my iPad today, so we will be able to film. So let's get started. Check it out, we got two inclines. So as you guys can see, I've been freehanding all this with chalk, but I thought it'd be cool Italians that I actually used the steps as a grid to match this incline with the incline up there. So go closely, the distance from the end to the end is six steps with the door being in the middle at the third step. So I was able to use that to get as close as possible to matching the inclines up. And I don't know about you, but I think that's pretty cool. So just a little tip. Now that we got the two inclines outlined, let's get the scaffolding set up and start working on the top. Check it out, Rivers Casino, Science Center, Heinz Field, Gateway Clipper, and then once this Miller Time sign is done, the sister bridges and all their glory will be right there. But we're calling it a day. Uh, day three, time to get back into the swing of things, but first we gotta stop and get our supplies, so let's get this started. We got our home base set up, it's day three and we're starting to color, which means we gotta tape off the edges and cover up the steps so we don't get paint everywhere. So, let's get to work. Not gonna lie, filming in staircases is damn near impossible to get some angles. I wish I could say taping was my favorite part, but it's not. Let's get this water started. base coat of blue down, we're gonna let this dry, but in the meantime, we're gonna start working on the inclines and some of the trees. Got a good bit of work done on day three. Gotta start cleaning up because the restaurant below is gonna be opening soon and we don't wanna gas them out with all the aerosol. Just finished up day three at Frank's and the owner mentioned that I look like a leprechaun with all the screen paint. But day three's in the books. Another day of painting, let's get to work. Go time, baby.
work today. I got most of the water finished, most of the trees finished. I'm so excited with how this is going. Let's keep hustling. Another day of painting in the books, finishing up because the restaurant's about to open again. I'm pretty satisfied. Tomorrow we're gonna get these buildings colored in and then it's time to start outlining. All right, it's another day of painting and today my beautiful fiance is going to be tagging along and lending a hand, so let's get to work. Just how I left it. All right. All right, baby, you ready to get some painting done today? Let's do it. Jess's first time on scaffolding. <laughs> I was not expecting this learning curve. <laughs> You're holding onto the wall. You're so good. <laughs> like, don't, literally. Don't. Don't. <laughs> Please don't let me die. Oh, it's so All right, baby. Feeling more comfortable on the scaffolding? Absolutely. Well, we're getting some work done. It's looking good. <laughs> <laughs> progress, progress, blue skies, baby. Look at the master at work. Do not be close to me. We got all the buildings colored in. Now it's time to start outlining the waves. Let's get it done. Looking good, baby. All right, we got the bottom half wavy. I'll be back bright and early tomorrow to finish the city. And I'm excited about how this thing's coming together. Boom, baby. Another day in the books. Jess is a huge help. How are you feeling today? I'm so tired. I'm exhausted. This is a long one, but it's looking good. All right, see you guys tomorrow. All right, another day of painting. Today I'm flying solo, and I'm hoping to finish everything up today. So let's get to work, baby. And there you have it. My first mural on a set of stairs is in the books. A very special thank you to the Wasik family and everybody at Frank's Bar and Grill for being so wonderful and supportive along this entire journey. As always, if you had fun, if you enjoyed yourself, and if you think you learned a thing or two, please like, comment, and subscribe to stay up to date with all the fun happening at Studio Time with Zach. And until next time, 
keep creating art. Now let's get to the details, check them out.